Peekaboo Street came to Sierra Nevada with only one thing in her mind, a gold medal in her favourite discipline, the downhill. Her confidence was already at a high, having taken one medal already in the Super G, which was a little bit against the run of play. There was no doubt that she was favourite for the women's downhill title, and the intermediate time showed that she was skiing at her very best over a second ahead of anybody else and Street, who is a real gliding machine made no further mistakes after that slight error on the jump her own unique style the wide stance almost like a speed skier slicing through the air and peekaboo street had a massive advantage 0.65 of a second. Katia Seitzinger, the German, had skied out, as we saw earlier in the Super G. There had been intense rivalry throughout last season between Seitzinger and Street, the American. Seitzinger, of course, went on to win the World Cup Super G title, and the overall World Cup title was hers at the end of the season. The one I think she really wanted was this one the World Championship downhill in Spain. But it wasn't to be, despite her immense technical ability, the speed, the size and the shape of the hill wasn't so much in her favor. And she was half a second behind the American. Hilary Lind rounded off a terrific day for the Americans by taking the bronze medal. Lind, another skier for the big occasion. She took a silver in 1992 in the Olympic down in Maribel and a bronze on this occasion at the World Championship. It was almost an American one, two and three because Megan Garrity had the run of her life to finish in fourth position. But the podium positions were gold for Piggly Street, silver for Katia Seitzinger and bronze for Hilary Lind. Isolde Kostner was highly fancied for a medal as well, but she perhaps peaked slightly too early with that gold in the Super G. Street was aware that this was possibly the last major threat to come, and the signs of relief on Peekaboo Street's face were evident at the end of Costner's run. It was a dream come true for the likeable Peekaboo Street on the highest step of the podium. The one thing that's missing for her now is the Olympic title. Watch this space in Nagano, 1998. I would like to say hello to my coaches family, Michelle, Dominique and Daniel. Hi, servus. Ich bin wirklich zufrieden mit dem Ergebnis, weil den ersten sechs Platzierten bin ich glaube ich die einzige, die jetzt nicht so als die Topgleiterin einzustufen ist und von daher glaube ich, ist ein gutes Ergebnis. Im Abendhimmel über der Sierra Nevada stand zum ersten Mal eine deutsche Läuferin auf dem Siegertreppchen. Katja Seitzinger links mit den Amerikanerinnen Street und Lind.